What's up, YouTube? We're back with another episode of Picks with Petey. I'm Petey, if you ain't know. Uh, today is the 27th of November. The mob be Thanksgiving, so happy holidays to you all. Um, I went one out of four yesterday. That's why I ain't, I ain't sad or nothing. It's just like, I'm like, what in the world? But day is, today is a new day. That's all that matters, so don't even dwell on it. But like share and subscribe for all y'all who be watching the videos and i appreciate y'all watching them anyway but i'm uh one two three four five six seven i got seven pick today i should have matter of fact now nah, i'm keeping it seven because i was going i was telling myself like with the uh, college prediction i did i was going to go back to maybe three threes or four or something like that but on college i did a two pick but i'm gonna go ahead and thug this seven out let's see what it do so uh, these these are the lines I got to make currently now, and this is how I feel about the games. It's how I feel they go. So you ain't got to listen to me. If you do listen to me and get something, that's good. Cause it's all about seeing other people winning, you winning with yourself. So so first game is the Heat playing the Rockets. They saying the Rockets gonna beat the Heat by six. I ain't worried about that. I'm feeling the uh, the over for this game is at two twenty seven. So I'm taking the over. For the Heat versus the Rockets. Then the next game, we got the Clippers playing the Grizzlies. I told y'all what they saying. The Clippers going to win by the eight. Let me tell you that first. And the old one is at 226 and a half. I told y'all like the Grizzlies no matter what. Because they put up a they put up fight. They got fight up in them. But I feel as though the Clippers going to win this game by the eight. Uh, the funny thing about it, yesterday they had the Clippers winning by two. And they, they beat them by ten or more or something like that. That was they played the Mavericks. But uh, I'm taking this eight points. And I'm taking the over at 226 and a half. So, but this is going to be the time I don't go with the Grizzlies. Then we got the Wizards playing the Suns. The Wizards lost the other day. They saying the Suns going to beat the Wizards by the eight. Then, you know, since they, you know, they played them last year when they traded Kelly Oubre. So, I was about to say this is going to be the first time they see each other. But this is going to be the first time they play each other, I think, in this season. So, but they saying the Suns going to beat them by the eight. But I got the Wizards covering that. Then the score set at 242 and a half. I'm taking the over as well. So the Wizards covering the eight points and the score to go over 242 and a half. Then we got the clip. I mean, not the Clippers. We got the Lakers playing the Pelicans. They saying the Lakers going by the seven against the Pelicans. And the uh, over under set at 231. I'm going to just go ahead and take the over in that game for the 231. That's it, even though the Lakers going to win too. I'm just taking the over in the game. Then we got uh, OKC playing the Trailblazers. It's saying Trailblazers going to win by three. I'm taking the three points with the Trailblazers to win, and they're over on this set at 220. So if I confuse y'all while I was talking, quick recap. We got uh, the Heat versus Rockets game going over 227. Then we got the Clippers winning by the eight against the Grizzlies, and the score to go over 226 and a half against the Grizzlies. Then we have... The Timberwolves, I know, I'm sorry, the Wizards, excuse me. The Wizards covering eight points against the Suns and the score to go over 242 and a half. Then we have the Lakers playing the Pelicans. That score to go over 231. Then we got the Trailblazers winning by the three against OKC. And that'll be another episode with Picks for Petey for the NBA prediction picks. You know the motto, get money, stay humble. Let's see if all these, these seven these seven pick predictions go right for me. So I'll see y'all next time.